All right, guys, here, new development. So we got, um, let's take a look at the map here. This map is full, so it's going to produce a, uh, default is single attack, counter attack, and the S, otherwise known as the Sega RNG, is the double attack. So, uh, trying to nail down the crit manipulation I was looking for a way to make it more consistent because I wasn't really sure what was going on, but I figured it out now. Uh, so here we go. We'll go through it once and then I'll try and explain it. Crit, 19 damage. All right, so what did it look like I did there? It looked like I just reset the turbo and then magically got a crit, right? There's actually one important step to this. Your turbo inputs have to be uh, correct. You can't have any erroneous, erroneous inputs. Um, and you have to obviously do it in, in a certain amount of time, but it's not that particular for putting the code in. The really particular point is when you're <clears throat> saying yes or no, this actually is where the rest of the manip happens. So you say yes, and then as soon as you say yes, you have to wait for the guy to shake his head no and yes one time and then you hold B to dismiss the, the next three to make it a no. And then once you get control of Peter, you pull it off just the same same way as you do any other uh, attack with a stored RNG manip. So we'll try it again here. I'm making sure that the inputs are pretty much perfect. Okay, that was wrong. You have to wait for that guy's head to do the thing. This should be a crit. Should be 19 damage. Yep. So there you go. Take a look at Input Viewer if you have any problems.